So let's say this is your company. You have a worker here, but a worker stopped working at this company and they left to another company. So they left to another company to work. Yeah. So your customer usually talk with this person. So in your company, they talk with this person. This is a contact person. Most time you have that. People call it account manager. And the account manager has the list of customer and they handle the relationship between the customer. Most time when the account manager leaves to another company, they need to assign a new um, um, account manager and those account manager take over the list. That's technically how it works. So what can you send to your customer in order for them to inform them about the new account manager? So let's look at it, what you can send them. So let's start with the subject first. Subject, this is an email that you send them. Yeah? If you communicate with them on uh, Telegram or WhatsApp or other things, you just need to send a text. So give me one second. So let's say your customer, you start with the subject of the email, this person no longer work with us. Yeah. And then you're going to start there. If you're still sending a bulk email, watch out because you need to make sure that the contact name is correct or contact name, contact name of customer name. Um, the thing is, you need to make sure that if you send an email, a bulk mail, make sure that this is correct because you don't want the uh, the wrong email to be received by another person you don't want that okay um let's see so you need to inform them so let's see um yeah we wish to inform you that um let's see the employee's name let's call it um employee your name so this is old remember yeah is no longer with our company and will no longer be the personal responsible for your account your so your new contact person your contact will be and then you'll be like yeah mm. so here we have employee again um yeah employee name and then you put new you see the difference new employee name and let's put it here because we do not know if he or she is a he or she yeah this also needs to be bold because something we need to change may be reached at you can put your phone number now number or email address email address email M. and then you put this we wish to take yeah I need the name again so I'm not going to write it all over again just copy it yeah, we wish to take this yeah. to show you that because I need to name that 
we'll perform same heights there's something the standard people will say in order to give your customer uh, a piece in their mind that nothing will change that, that that is about the service that your company is providing to expect of our employees right okay let's see if they got this right we wish to inform you that x is no longer with our company i will no longer be the person responsible for your account okay your contact will be hey he may be he or she may be reached at phone number email address we wish to take this opportunity to assure you so give them a peace of mind that the new will perform at the same height high standards that you have come to expect of our employees yeah okay this seems fine yeah it seems fine okay let's continue um as always okay um we look forward to serving you and wish we need all to you well in remember his we need to have put his or her future and the verse feel free to contact me or um new employee if you have any questions or if we may be of any assistance right assistance yeah so as always we look forward to serving you and wish old well in her of this future and of us please feel free to contact me or neil if you have any question or if he may be of any assistance yeah sounds okay right yeah so this is something that you can use um we are missing the what do you call it the the signature most of the time at the end of the email most people have a signature so we just copy it if you have your own signature you can put your own signature but uh, we create something this is up to you to change how you want well look nice right i have a dream that's all i need i'll make it happen with some work and belief know what i want so i'll take it on i've made mistakes but mistakes make you strong let's break it down for a minute i want the crown i'm gonna get it you hear me loud man i'm winning yeah charlie sheen will be